Hey, what a shot, guys? Shift here. Welcome back to Life is Strange, Season 1, Episode 2, Part 2. Yeah, I'm, I'm still trying to get to uh, where I last left off. So I'm still going to be my. I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. This isn't a toy, Chloe. I do have to be careful how I use it. Screw that! Of course it's a toy! The best toy ever? You can bang anyone with no strings attached, rewind time, and boom! It's like it never happened! Grow up. Maybe you made a move on me and I would never know. Yes, that's what I did. You can rewind time, Max. That's uh, let me make sure if I've done some things right quick. Yep, 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 yep. And I know how to get the last five, so... Fucking yeah. insane! Hey. We have to play! I don't have time. You did not just say that. Uh, check out your nose. Too much blow? Yeah, that's just hey, true. you okay? Too much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again? Then let's go to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. Oh, yeah. Uh, hmm. Okay, Supergirl, let's go to my secret place. Don't even answer. We have places to go and people to do. Come on, before Mom starts some more shit, let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Blackwell. Big whoop. You don't call me once in five years and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? Biatch. I see how you roll. So go ahead, chat up Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other people to hang out with, too. I'm sorry, I'm answering this one. Hey, Kate. What's up? Please, don't let your best friend get in the way. You okay? I promise, Kate. I won't forget. I swear. Just do your homework and don't stress. I really don't think we should go into this right now. I'll call you later, okay? Thanks, Max. If you'd rather chill with Kate, please, go ahead. You are ridiculous. I'm chilling with you, okay? For now. Let's rock. All right, let's go. Sucks that Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. Well, you're being a good friend, Max. That's all that matters. are you going to get pissed at me this week? That depends on you and how well you do in this phase of the test. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Uh -huh. Raw and rough. It suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back and she's also supersized? We don't know for how long. Exactly why it's time to have fun. Yeah, you don't want to be like Super Mario. Don't eat the mushroom. David might be a douche, but you did steal his gun. Is everybody armed in Arcadia Bay now? Only the ones who shouldn't be, like Step Dildo. Until now. Wait, are you the same one that says you believe in yet, gun control? Shay. You are the revolution, Max. So we should figure out how to best use and abuse your power with a test. Drink? Yuck. <laughs> you are so cute. You haven't changed a bit. Okay, let's do this. Can you find five bottles while I prep the shooting range? Gear right. and guns. <laughs> nice combo. That's a stupid combo, if you, you ask can handle me. It. Now go find us five bottles, pretty please. Why not you? I have to find dirty ass bottles while you chill. Not fair. I have to prep the range, crybaby. And I've been tripping hard about where you got this rewind power. From God? Or the gods. So, bow. We can <laughs> make the world bow. Are you ready for that? Mm, nah. No way. I'm more of I a still don't even know how my power works. Type of person. Or for how long. But Dude, you fuck shit up, you stubborn. rewind, you fix it. Drop the mic. Boom. Spin, rinse, and repeat. 
I'm just altering time and space. Oh yeah, and history. <laughs> no biggie. You already altered history by saving my life, smartass. Let's see what else you can do. Fine. <laughs> Photo. All right. Yeah, the rest of these are pretty later on, except for the dead one. That that's actually kind of near. Look what we have here. A cute little bottle for the taking. Uh -huh. Hello, bottle number one. Four more to go. Is that right if I say screw this section? I'm being completely honest here. Mm. Way heavier than I thought. Ugh. Seems like a chill Ooh, place. Only three bottles left. I don't know if I do. Although this junkyard is a dive, I see why Chloe hangs here. Yeah, I see why. Because there's a boat. It actually feels like Chloe and I are kids again. We're hiding out and plotting our future. Also, that there's a freaking boat here. Well, half of one actually. Well, let's look, probably get that certain column back on there. Get a light up there. Add a door. Yeah, I think it would be pretty good. Hmm. All this rusted metal makes me feel serene. Shireen. Am I morbid or just goth? I don't know what morbid means. I don't want to intrude, but now we're officially a trio. We just have to find Rachel. I. Three down, two more to go. I want to die. <sighs> Jeez. Who wrote it? So Rachel did go to a Vortex Club party. This flyer is dated right before she disappeared. That kind of hurts. They really were besties. That could have been me instead of Rachel. Rachel songs. I wonder if Chloe would ever... I can't see Chloe playing with makeup. This is the scariest thing here. Wow, sir. That looks exactly like the same doe from my tornado vision. That doe is the perfect photo op. What does a dope uh, boat supposed to mean? Or spirit animals and all that? Is it supposed to mean something? Yoink. Mm. One more bottle to go.
Thanks for the tip. There's no mofo here. I like that. Carry on. That fire's so I'm sure this is a popular party pit. That fire's so going. Voila. Now I can deliver this bottle booty to Captain Chloe. Three, two, one. I still be kind of need to get that boat in the water. Not that boat, I'm talking about that a boat. That's more of a speed boat. Alright, I got your damn bottles. Thanks, Max. Wait, one more for the road. You're serious about this. We're gonna shoot all these bottles without wasting a single bullet. Max, you have to help me aim. I don't like this. Show me the way, Max. I need to see you shoot first. Straight and true. And this thing's come over slightly. Show me the way. Aim a bit to the right. Sir, yes, sir. Duh. That was so fucking cool. Now for the second bottle. Now, Max, where do I aim? You're on target. Hold the trigger. Please come up a little bit. Now, Max, aim slightly above. Right between the eyes. Watch out, Nathan. Now that is fun. What is that Let's pistol pump sound up the like volume and find me another rifle. target. I want to get creative here. Give me something to shoot, Max. Let's take out this wheel rim on your left. Taking out the wheel rim now? Quick shades and hit her. Oh, well, no, I don't know. Hella yes! Nice shooting, Tex. Now that's what I'm talking about. She's not Texan and she's not. Like, never? So I want one more mm -mm. uber cool trick tux. shot. I'm How tux. about using that junker for a target now? Dude, let's see what happens when you shoot the gas tank. Step back, gas tank go boom. <laughs> boom! Car definitely down, but no bottle casualties. I still think it's pretty cool though. Shoot How the about tire. For the left tire. Adios, spinning wheel of death. Poor car did, did Uber nothing cool. deserve this. I cannot believe this is for reals. My best friend is a superhero. Now it's your turn to bust a cap. <laughs> I don't know. Max, your nose. It's bleeding. Damn. The blood. I don't feel so oh, sorry. Crap. Max! You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? A little. Thanks for helping me. Just give me a minute. Too much action for Arcadia? Maybe not enough. 
This is kind of fun. Scary and stupid, but fun. Let me know when you feel okay. God, this power really messes with, with my head. Glad I feel normal again. I better go chat up Chloe. Click. <laughs> Look at her. Chloe can even chill out playing with a gun. All right, let's go. Okay, looks like you're ready to lock and load. I don't know about this. Are you afraid of getting in trouble? Oh, boo-hoo, Max is afraid. I know you can handle this, and I'm here to guide you. Make me proud, sister. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. Or is it Bonnie and Clyde? Excuse us, Frank. Oh, sorry, Chloe. Don't let me get in the way of your bonding. I heard the gunshots and the breaking glass. It's cute that you're playing with guns. Just like me at your age. We're not anything alike, ma'am. We both need money. In fact, you need it so bad, you owe me a shitload, don't you, Chloe? Huh? You'll get your money. Don't they all say that? You know, even when they're broke and acting tough. What are you hiding there, girly? Let me see. Where did you get that bracelet? A friend, and it's none of your goddamn business. You're my business now, That's and I- That's Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. No, it wasn't. You stole that shit. Give it to me right now, asshole. You better step back before you regret it, girl. I mean it. You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, please step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Don't test me, Frank. That is hilarious. Oh, man. I'll remember you, kid. I'll remember you almost shot me. And you'll wish I had no memory because I never forget. You have until Friday to pay me. Don't ever pull crap like this again. It'll be the last time you do. Try bullets next time, brainiacs. Sorry. You are awesome. Thanks for standing up for me. Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. Jesus, I almost shot this guy. And now he'll be more dangerous to Chloe and me. Well, let's get the hell out of here. Wow, sir. Why did Frank have Rachel's bracelet? We need to talk about this later, but I better follow Chloe now. Wow, well, bracelet? Hold on. That's over here. Wait on. I remember seeing the bracelet inside here. Yeah, that's what I thought. So you take a look. Folks, listen up. This is Rachel's bracelet. And um, she might make another one for Frank. But if Chloe was smart, she'll look through here and find these here. What the hell? That kind of hurts. I, but attention to detail, man. Chloe's waiting to go for a walk. I still can't believe you pulled a gun on Frank. That was epic. It felt awful. 
I'm glad there was no bullets in there. You can just rewind time in your hand and stick that barrel right at Frank's ass. You have the power! You're gross. Don't fall. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. Chloe, why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. Feels like a different world, huh? I wish we could Hi. stay forever. Isn't it weird having half Can we of build another blink? pirate fort and keep the world out? We need a new secret hangout. At least Frank wouldn't find us. Are you okay, Max? Seriously, Chloe, this is scary. What if Frank tries to track us down? I'm sorry. But Frank isn't as hardcore as he fronts. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and mangy dog. Chloe, did you see what just happened? I almost shot him. I know I could rewind, but Chloe, this is not playtime. No more guns. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying Frank off. Now, tell me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does he have a last name? Frank Bowers. Obviously don't get my pot from you, remember? Anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Hung out? Hung out? You don't mean you... Ah, oh, no, we didn't have sex. Gross, man. He never even tried. I just made the mistake of borrowing money so Rachel and I could bail out of here. That's it? No. I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? I think we have to be careful and keep an eye on this guy without him eyeballing us, okay? Ah, it's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens, and it's like no time has passed. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Kerouac knew. It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at night. Look at the bead poet here. I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. You just have to stop being afraid. Quit being a little bitch and take those pictures. I'm so salty. Perfect. Take off the boots. What's that noise? The train. Oh shit. Ah shit indeed. Take. I can definitely use this bad boy. have a life of something like that. Shit, I can't budget at all. Uh, score. Come on, Max. Hurry. Now I can pull a total MacGyver. Please get me out of here. I'm coming, I'm coming. Not easy with all this. A 
awesome. It's not locked. Please, get me out of here! But which wire to cut? Red. Now that's the right cable. Yes! I did it! You okay? You saved me again! Crazy! Now we're totally bonded for life. Damn. That was close. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time in your lair, but... I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. Uh -huh. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. Yeah, I just want to make sure of something real quick. All right, continuing. Right. There we go. Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. Explain what? Snow equals a ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? <sighs> You're high. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? Uh... What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? Five years ago, asswipe. Some people change. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar! Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. Back to the Chloe. little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wandering. So are you going to that Vortex club party? Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex club soiree. Really? Oh, oh like you, you care. I do? I'm not anti-soiree. You Isn't seem so anti-fashion, though. A Vortex Club party has a strict dress code. Do you even have a dress? <laughs> Sorry, but well, nice dress try. Dress as long as you possibly can. If it was a soiree, that would be sophisticated as shit. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Matt. Really? Oh. I'm sure the Vortex Club has a dress code. As you can see, I would need your advice on what to wear. Thanks, Max. I didn't think you noticed high fashion. Tell you what. I'll put you down on the guest list, and before the party, I can give you some tips. Cool. Thanks, Courtney. I'll send you the party info later. Back to the list. Au revoir. You know, this, in this game, I hear a lot more French than I did in Assassin's Creed Unity. And that's saying something. Max, can we talk? Mm -hmm. I don't know about that. Do you mind if we talk about what happened yesterday with Chloe? Uh, you hit her? You hit Chloe. I'm sure she told you why. Did she mention she probably stole one of my guns? You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. But I, I didn't care about her. I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was outraised in a lot more hell. 
She's better than that. All you kids are. I'm guessing you're Oklahoma. So is Kate Marsh. What about Kate? I shouldn't have said anything. You know about that video going around. Is that why you hassled Kate yesterday? I took a photo of that moment for surveillance sake. Soldier, you don't have the facts. You think I'm a hypocrite because I want cameras around here for the safety of the students? That'll take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. Then quit egging it on, on David. It's quite simple. If you don't want to fight, do not pick it. I know what you're trying to do, sir. Sorry, I'm I'm I salty for hypocrites. Shopping for the party. That reminds me, I have to score some weed from Nathan. Dude, you're gonna, it's gonna be like Taco Bell. Luke is always using the phone as a shield to avoid people. Yo, Maxwell Smart. Talk later, cool? So you can't help me? I'm trying. Think, big brain, think. Mm -hmm. Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this I chemical don't that way. Asking me for help means you're screwed. Have to add yeah. either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Sodium. I have a vision. Godium. Godium? That's the worst pun I've ever heard. Yet Max has spoken. Sodium it is. So this is one that makes it explode, right? Damn. This can't be. Hey. Have to. Potassium. I'm not sure why you're letting me I'm decide your whole fate, shit but ton of potassium. Go potassium. Potassium uh -oh. it shall be. If this works, you get a free hug. If you take out the pot, the pot and the ISM, you have ass. Weird science. Maxwell, hey. asking half daddy. I'm not sure why you're like potassium. It shall be if this. Nope. I want to talk to her for a quick second. Howdy, Brooke. Hi, Max. Making your daily rounds? Uh... How was your drone? Miss Grant busted me flying it over the parking lot. She's all jacked up about surveillance bullshit. Like I was spying on Warren's new car. You already planted a GPS on him? I borrowed the one he has on you. Oh. I hate to hit and run, but... Don't let me get in your way. So long. That's kind of creepy. I bet if I touch the glass, all these creepy sea critters will pop up. Or nothing will happen at all. Gotta poke it a little bit. Da Vinci was a boss. I, I agree. My Nancy will agree too. Hi, Miss Grant. Funny, I was just thinking about you, Max. Thanks again for taking a stand against camera surveillance here. Every signature counts. I, I agree. Uh, how's your petition going? How's your campaign going? You signed the petition, now it's your campaign too. Thanks for stepping up. More people would rather send a text than sign a petition. That's how they keep us all distracted. Say paper. Nobody will notice cameras on every square foot. I know. 
I really hope you keep those cameras from taking over Blackwell. Max, with students like you, we sure will. I'm just thinking about all the autumn photos I want to take. Oh, this is my favorite time of year. I do love the season change. I agree. This well, whole this campus is a visual delight. I know Mr. Jefferson loves to shoot around here. You must know Mr. Jefferson pretty well by now. I certainly know him as a talented artist and terrific teacher. I've been here a little longer, but he's made a bigger mark. I have to say, it's not quite oh, odd uh, enough I yet. saw what you did there. Uh, snow? What about that snow yesterday? What's your scientific explanation? Our climate is moving beyond explanation. Of course, some of the tribes here might see it different. Well, the experiment. Miss Grant, can I ask you a possibly dumb science question? You know my stock teacher answer. There are no dumb questions. Ask away. Would you add potassium or sodium to a chemical mix for this week's experiment? Neither. Unless you want a face full of powder. I would add chlorine. I'm sorry, Miss Grant, but I have to get going. Go on, Max. We'll talk again. Real soon. I. Hey, well. Maxwell. I have that. Warren, this seems kind of dangerous. You might as well flip a switch, Frankenstein. I'm the only mad scientist without a faithful Igor. I'll choose using the scientific method. Heeny, meeny, miny, mo. Potassium. Weird science. Hey. Have that. I actually think you should use a lot of potassium. I mean, a <laughs> shitload. See? Look at that smile. You're going to become a scientist yet. Uh, Let's no, do this thing. This something a little bit more better than a... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> she blinded me with... <laughs> 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 I know, I know, I'm a bastard. Alright, for real now. Have that. Chlorine. Wrong, Warren. You need to add chlorine. Not potassium or sodium. Chlorine? I didn't think of that. Can't argue with a confident scientist. Let's try it. Eureka. Eureka. She's got it. No, you got it. Yeah. That was fun helping Warren. He's pretty cute when he's in full-on geek mode. Excuse me, Max? Can you come over here? Sure. You look worried. Is everything okay? Just between you and me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. You're not the only one. Do you have something you want to tell me? I saw David Madsen harassing Kate yesterday. He was scaring her. Mr. Madsen confuses fear with security. I I'm sorry. Kate had to be a target of his paranoia. If you had proof, I could talk to Principal Wells. Oh yes, I have an actual photograph for once. Let me see that photo after class. You're already thinking like a real photographer. And Max? I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? Uh... Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? I... Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's 
Hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel, too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. That was a private conversation. Not that I wouldn't tell you. This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? I you would never make that like kid is made. I'd like to believe that, Max. And that principal should it know. Just seems like there's a lot of trauma around you this week. Listen, should I? Excuse me, Max. Hello. Yes. Uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. I. I saw. Make me beautiful, Hayden. Vogue, Vogue, Vogue. Nina, you are out of control. Turn left, then right. Show me the love. How do I look, Taylor? You look like ass. Not now, Max. I'm contemplating shit. All right. I'm kind of doing something now, Max. No time to talk, Max. Posing in progress. will be pissed we're sitting at her desk. Oh, I'm sure she'll report it. Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. Did you think we were best friends forever or something? Not at all, Victoria. You know about so Max like big is such of a show in head. Whore. You would know. Can I sit down now? Oh, please do. Take a selfie of this moment. Yeah, Max. So I won't forget you. Screw up, Prescott. Assholes. What's up, Daniel? Waiting to draw Dana after Hayden gets his paparazzi on. I hope you liked the sketch I did of you yesterday. It was great. Love. And it's my new avatar. Excellent. I got tons of likes on FB. Ah, made you blush. <laughs> Shut up. Someday your portrait may hang in the Daniel de Costa wing of the Louvre. We'll talk about it later. Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong and weird. What up, Max? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say, and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit Maybe down. I'll we have a lot to cover today, and so little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like you're giggling about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student or a friend. I guess Kate in this class now. False images of yourself shot out all I'm worried them. about her. Usually, people need something to judge, so they never take a good look. No smartphones in class, Max. Put that away. <laughs> look at themselves. We can thank reality TV for some of that. In the end, we can only blame ourselves for participating. Speaking of participation, there are a few souls here who have yet to enter a photo in the contest. Like Max Caulfield, for example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? Bye. I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying chiaroscuro. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Although we don't technically see in my- Yo! Some crazy shit is going down at the girl's dorm! Zachary, do not come into my class like that ever again. Listen, everybody remain seated. 
Are you crap, mate? This is, this is like one to be Florida. You don't know what's going to happen. You see that? Is this for real? I. It flipped out. I didn't think she was that messed up. Uh oh. Up there. Kate! No! Oh god. I, I have to do something to help her. I hope not again. Not now. I have to try something. I won't be able to rewind again and again. Hello, birds. Go to the roof. The roof. Yes. Oh. What are you doing here, Max? Stop. Don't come near me. Not now. Won't work. I don't have any power. Now I have to do this by myself. Did you come to get another Pulitzer shot like yesterday, Max? I only wanted proof that David was harassing you. More like you wanted another shot for the Max Caulfield scrapbook. You want another now? Huh? No. Please, Kate. You know me better than that. And I know you don't want to jump. But I do. My life is already over. Kate, your life is still yours. And we can get through this together. Let me help. Like I helped by erasing all that crap people wrote on your room slate. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. That makes me feel better. Uh. Of course I worry. You're my friend, Kate. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. I always feel like you really listen. Kate, please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. This morning I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. That's your story now. How can I trust you? What about this morning when I needed help? You told me to do nothing. Kate, I'm gathering proof that Nathan Prescott drugged you. And you're not the only victim. So you have to help me take Nathan down. Nathan Prescott? That makes sense. He's a scumbag. Scumbag. You have proof now? Soon. Then straight to the police. Think of it like... We're cleansing Blackwell. You do have my back, Max. That's the first time I've felt hopeful in a week. Good. We all need to have each other's backs. So I want you to come with me now. Please. You don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself to sleep. Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. Morty on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Uh. Kate. 
Kate, this is our chance to beat the boys. Yeah, I think this is the right one. That's the only way we can win against them. Can we really, Max? I don't believe in miracles anymore either. Now I do. You're part of the reason why. If you come down with me, I can tell you more. You're such a good person, Max. Even if you're full of crap. But I'll come with you. You're my friend. Forever. Can we hug on it? No. Nobody cares about me. Nobody. Uh, your sister. I saw that cute photo of you with your sisters in your room this morning. I can see how much your little sister loves you by her smile. That's Lynn. She's only 10. She does have the best smile ever. I would hate to see her sad. Then make Lynn happy and step towards me. If she was here, you would know what to do. This isn't the end, Kate. There's no way God doesn't have big plans for you here. Nice try, Max. But God put me on this route. Um, uh, was it Matthew 28 or is it Proverbs? Um. Hold on, I want to figure out this. Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Matthew eleven twenty eight. I can't believe you quoted one of my favorite passages. Like I said, I care about you. I know this passage means a lot to you. Yes. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. It's fine, Lass. It's fine. You saved me from You're talking to class. <laughs> now, I know today was difficult for everybody, but I'm so proud of the way Blackwell pulled together to save a young girl's life. Of course, you're quite a hero for getting Kate to come down, Max. I didn't do much. She's modest. Like a real hero. Yeah, real hero. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. What happened today should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen. As our head of security here, those roof doors should always be locked. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not, and that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through, but Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. All right, I gotta go with David. Mr. Madsen was bullying Kate. Oh, grow Excuse up. Excuse me, I was there. 
I saw you getting in her face. You have no idea what you saw. Kate Marsh was involved with a bad crowd. I was trying to find out who. Kate had a double life. I was super shocked when I found out. No, you were part of the crowd. And like I said, I personally saw David physically harass Kate Marsh. You lying little... Shh. Are you gonna take this troublemaker's word over your security officer? Except I have proof. Here's a photo I took of David and Kate yesterday. That's not... Not proof. Hold on. That's pretty much this isn't proof. a courtroom. But I feel it would be in the best interest of Blackwell and this situation to put you on temporary leave. We will continue this conversation later. Hopefully with Miss Marsh when she's out of the hospital. Are you fucking kidding me? Ugh, this is major bullshit. I led troops into battle and you're letting this punk lead you? No. I am sorry, David. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and student just tried to kill herself. They don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me, but I think I can use my power again. Well, I think we know less now than when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. I couldn't even believe it was happening. It was literally slow motion as I grabbed her hand. And then I could feel her grabbing mine. Max, that was the greatest thing I've ever seen. Ever! You reached out, she reached out, hugs, tears, applause, like a superhero. Not quite. Look at me. I'm a mess. You're glowing. Seriously, a human halo. I'm pretty sure you earned your wings today. <laughs> I'm still worried about Kate. She did try to kill herself. <laughs> All over a video. Viral is the right word. Like a disease. So you watched it? Just one. And a half times. Warren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Oh, and I agree. Proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight-up dickhead. So, what do you think is really happening? That's what a billion the hell dollar is question. This? The weather confirms a this A bloody day. eclipse. Ah, oh, great. Like chill. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I would know. I would. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. Insert music here. Da, 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 da. Screw you, copyright. Hey, hey, hey. Hmm? Oh, wrong, wrong game.
You know, Life is Strange 2, Episode 2, or Life is Strange Episode 2 of Season 1. It was a good episode, actually, in my honest opinion. It was really good. Decent written, well acted, I guess. But I can't wait to play the remaster just to see how different it is from the original game. Oh, there's a skip button. Nope. Uh. <laughs> Plus, that's how we got here. Looks like nothing. Whole lot of books and a whole lot of nothing. All right. Yep. Mm hmm Oh, crap. Oh, my eardrums. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. I've got the thing way up, cranked up. Ow. That kind of, that kind of scared me. Oh, well, you guys know what to do. If you guys liked it, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace and rock on.